Hey friends, my name is Basti. Welcome to this new video on my channel Fossil Wildlife. And thank you, thank you for your support. Uh, this channel reaches over 100 subscribers, and so I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Every um, subscribe, uh, every like, every comment. So let me know how you're doing. Um, what fossils can you find in your region? Let me know. Ask questions. I read and answer them all. And um, yeah, in this video, I show you Ice Age bison fossils, like these bones here, and um, jaws and single teeth I found uh, in the gravel pit here in Germany. And yeah, so let's go. So let's start with these bones here. This is a tibia. So it's part of the Rarex bisons. And this is a radius bone. And radius bones are part of the front legs. So you see here two leg bones of Ice Age bisons. And then I just want to show you the bison skull uh, again, but quickly. So you saw this bison, this half of a bison skull in this video. And um, yeah, big piece, big piece. It weighs a lot. <laughs> yeah, so just want to show you this. And now one of my best finds uh, I've ever found in this gravel pit so far, in my, in my opinion, is this bison jaw. So you see the two teeth here, the uh, two molars. The third molar is, uh, is broken here, and the premolars are missing. But um, I found the rest of it the same day, a few minutes later, and then we have this entire bison jaw so they can fit together easily like this here and you can uh, see always um, also that this is the right lower jaw the right mandible and because of this curve here then the left would be here and go something like this so this is the right mandible of a bison, of an Ice Age bison. This is just the broken jaw, the left mandible, left lower jaw of a bison. And um, then we have also this piece here. It's also broken, but this jaw was intact, but then, I don't know, the machines or yeah the time you know in the last thousands of years uh, the jaw is broken it's broken but you can see the tooth here really nice with the entire root really nice one and I can put it in the jaw perfectly here and yeah can close the jaw <laughs> And then uh, I couldn't find the rest of the jaw, but I could find the two other teeth of the jaw. So you can see they have the same color, so they belong together. And then I found the and then I found these teeth here as well. And I can tell you that these are the molars. So the last teeth of the jaw of this bison. Really nice preserved, but um, I couldn't find the jaw, the rest of the jaw, where these teeth, uh, yeah, were sticking. But um, this tooth is in the jaw, and that's really nice. In my collection of the single teeth of bison's, um, so this is my single, my single place here for uh, the teeth. So you see here the the horse teeth and the mammoth teeth I found. And um, yeah, here are all my bison teeth. So this is a really nice molar, really nice dark blue color. And um, yeah, this is also a pretty one.
you can identify bison teeth by this bump here of enamel so you can see it on every single tooth here this bump of enamel here as well so uh, with it you can really identify bison teeth quite well and um, there it is uh, as well here this little bump here some of them are really well preserved so you can see the whole root on this tooth and the color it's it's gorgeous and as always you can see here the bump of enamel and then on this tooth maybe you saw this the color on it it's it's just awesome and uh, complete the entire root you see really well preserved to tooth really nice one and here's always as always the bump here in the middle Yeah, this was the last tooth I found. Um, yeah, really nice tooth. And this is the tooth I found with this mammoth tooth. On one day, it, it was the first day in the gravel pits. Um, so I found this mammoth tooth and this, I think it's from an Orox, not bison um, because of the length it's not so large as a bison so I think it's from an aurox but you can see the color this green blue really nice so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve single bison teeth and then the jaw pieces here this one and this one as well here so i can tell you that uh, bison fossils are the most common fossils i can find in the gravel pit uh, with horse fossils and um, deers but mammoth fossils as is molars um, and woolly rhinoceros uh, uh, bones and teeth like this pelvis like this pelvic bone or these, this jaw piece here are much rarer than bison or horse fossils. And here we have some pieces um, which were given to me by a friend. So you see a piece of mammoth tooth, mammoth molar you saw in this video. And um, But we have here a jaw piece, a mandible of bison, um, for sure bovite both it so a cow aurochs or bison so we have uh, here the one two three molars and here the premolars and then we have two juvenile jaw pieces firstly this one When, then we have also this little jaw. So there's also a tooth here. Piece of a juvenile, juvenile uh, bison or aurochs. Yeah, you saw this deer jaw in uh, this video here. Click here to watch this. And uh, here the fox jaw, the cat jaw. The wild boar jaws uh, in the mineralization video. And here are some bones I found in another a gravel pit uh, near my home. Um, yeah, this is a humerus, a bison humerus. A really big animal, big mammal. Massive bison, adult, adult uh, bison for sure. But then we have this juvenile horn core. 
So this is from a juvenile a bison, a little horn core. So the horn itself would be a bit larger, but um, this horn core is it's one of the tiniest you can find. Then uh, we have this astragalus bone. So it's part of the knee bones. Uh, also this is a bone uh, near the knee of the bison. This is astragalus. And yeah, then we have... I don't know if this toe bone belongs to a bison or to a deer. Um, if you know, if you have an idea, let me know. Um, bison or deer uh, toe bones. Yeah, then with the two bo toe bones, we have this uh, the, 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 these cannon bones here. Only a nice one. You know, um, these ones are from horses, yeah, horse uh, cannon bones, and bison or deer. I'm not, I'm not sure, and uh, I can't explain you the difference between bison and deer cannon bones. So, if you have an idea, let me know and write it in the comments. Yeah, I uh, want to say that uh, the weather was really bad in the last days, we had a lot of snow here, uh, which is really unusual for my region here in Germany. And yeah, it, it was really cold and it was raining and um, yeah, anyway, uh, hopefully the weather gets gets better and um, we can go fossil hunting next week together and uh, yeah, that I have a new fossil hunting video for you where we go on the hunt for these Ice Age bones, teeth and jaws. And um, yeah, if you like this content, let me know and like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done that and we see you in the next video.